All right, guys, here we are. We're going to take a quick flight around Van Nuys, California. This is just a test of the recording system, so I might as well just give it the full, the full treatment here. So we're in this uh, Remos uh, XG, or G Remos GX is what it is, Remos GX. I love this little airplane. Obviously, a little light sport airplane. Let's get the plane all set up here. Let's get things turned on. <clears throat> Been a little bit sick, so I might be uh, a little horse. Actually, I'm a big horse. Yeah, haha, ha, that's real funny. All right, uh, let's real quick turn this into Van Nuys so we could easily get our way back uh, if we get lost. Not very likely, but uh, we'll do it anyway. I'm inputting these uh, numbers. I've got the Saytech, uh, I don't know, the, one of the multi panels, and I'm just tuning in KV. VNY, that's it. VNY went too far. Yeah, anyway, I'm using the SATEC panel and inputting those, which is a lot easier than fiddling around with these uh, mouse buttons. So, yeah, that's really nice. And now I can, once that's in there, I can go scroll through. And uh, I'm still using the mouse, obviously, for that. Clicking a button is a lot easier than uh, fiddling around with. Uh, those knobs. Okay, so let's start this bugger up. Turn my fuel on, get my marker lights on, and fire it up. Oh, let's try this again. Yeah, fuel's not on. One more. There we go. All right. We're started. Bring up the volume here so I can hear what the engine's doing. So let's just grab a runway here and get the heck on the road or on the in the sky all right let's do this transponder on standby not that it makes any difference because our artificial intelligence is not that intelligent well no we're not using AI we're not using artificial intelligence we're using that uh, uh, what program or plugin is it uh, uh, live live traffic it's a free plugin right now uh, that's on the, the dot org and I really like it because it's monitoring real uh, real air traffic uh, using radar data so any airplanes we see looks like there might be one on the runway now but any airplanes we see are actual airplanes in real life that are buzzing around so but like I say no point in uh, squawking anything because it's irrelevant in this situation except just for so you don't get build up bad habits which it's easy to do when you're using a flight simulator to build up bad habits but uh, nonetheless um, I guess this is for fun and also for practice so there's nothing wrong with practicing to have fun so that's what we're doing here uh, where am I hold on where am I I forgot this airplane does not have tow brakes I forget sometimes. This is, has um, the Remos has got a handbrake, so I have. Uh, let me turn off that stupid marker beacon. There we go. Yeah, the Remos doesn't have tow brakes. It has a handbrake, so I've got one of my uh, uh, throttle controls or one of my axis controls on the throttle quadrant to to act as a handbrake. And it's easy to forget that. Uh, that you don't have tow brakes. Um, so here we are. We're taking, don't know what runway it is, and there is an airplane at the end, and we don't care. I'm assuming he's going to move first. So here we go. Runway 34, that's where we're taking off. Runway 34. Forgot to set my trim also. So we need to climb out at 65 thereabouts, but I don't want my nose way up in the air, just in case there's an airplane I'm going to plow into, or birds or something, and I do see an airplane sitting there in, I don't know where it's at, one of, one of the taxiways, or one of the, um, what's he doing, looks like he's just sitting there, with his nose, nose pointing up in the air, oh, we'll let him do that, all right, Looks 
looks like a hazy day in California. And I have a phone call. Let's see who's on the phone. Hello. All righty, cutie pie. All right, bye, cutie. Well, we'll end the video right here since uh, I got to go get dinner started. So, uh, looks like everything's working well. So I will pause this and stop the video.